the door. Can't you smell it? You, this place smells great. I, I have been coming to this chocolate shop and recommending it for years. J. Emanuel Chocolatier, located at 461B Main Street in Chester, is a nationally recognized confectioner. This J. Emanuel Chocolatier's shop started out about 20 years ago. Um, a third generation chocolatier, Jonathan Emmanuel uh, Dubrat, had uh, started this business uh, from his father's recipes. They have been featured in the Wall Street Journal, Sakara Aficionado, Forbes, Wine Enthusiast, and other periodicals. Using the, uh, the original recipe for Chester Crunch, which is this here, Classic Crunch, dark and milk, we also have now have a white version, which is covered in cashews and cranberries. But it still remains one of our better sellers today. It was an original recipe from 20 years ago, the original owner, uh, the Dubrat family. The product line includes wine truffles, Classic Crunch, Dish of the Decade by the New Jersey Star Ledger in 2010, Deluxe Assorted Truffles, and other great confections. Tad Van Leer, who became the next owner uh, previous to me, uh, had an idea to market his wine-infused truffles. Uh, this came out of a conversation with uh, some vintners out in Napa Valley. They were sitting around a fireplace and saying, well, you know, wine has a lot of properties that are similar to chocolate, which is also complex in flavors and properties. So they said, well, let's uh, put them together and see what happens. And that's how he decided to come into this business in a small little tiny shop in Chester, New Jersey to test market his product. Flowing nice. There's no hang-ups. See, there's little pieces get stuck in there, so I had to kind of free it up to make sure that the truffle gets totally covered. The wine truffles is a J. Emanuel chocolate exclusive. The sweet simplicity of rich dark chocolate, the complex sophistication of fine wine. Jane Emanuel Chocolate Art marries the two in their exclusive wine truffles collection. We use all the different wine flavors, the typical ones you're likely to buy at the house and bring home. Uh, it's the red wines, like the Merlots, the Pinot Noirs, the Syrah, uh, Cabernet Sauvignon is a big seller, Zinfandel, Bordeaux, uh, even Chardonnay. Chardonnay is the only white wine that we actually use because the properties of the wines in the white families are not robust enough to come through the chocolate. It's like a block. It's, when it gets hard enough, this is at a perfect consistency for, for cutting up because it's not breaking. And now that makes it a perfect square. Just as each wine has in a distinctive character, so does each J. Emanuel wine truffle. We try to keep things seasonal and so that they become special for our customers when they come back. For instance, we just discontinued our eggnog, which was good for Christmas time. Uh, the peppermint will run out and that'll be gone and, that'll, and then uh, we'll be coming in with something new for Valentine's Day, like a passion fruit uh, uh, truffle, uh, passion fruit marshmallows, um, and then Easter will be focusing on coconut and uh, different things that are associated with Easter. The classic rich almond butter crunch is dipped in chocolate and breaded in almonds and pecans. So what we're doing here is actually breading the uh, crunch, which is, like I said, our best seller. I have been known to come up here and help them make chocolate. Mm. And popcorn. And chocolate-covered popcorn, uh -huh. three, three different kinds of popcorn. Because this is a great place. There are not many, po I mean, what's the option? Going to a grocery store and buying a Hershey bar? <laughs> come on. This is so much better. This J. Emanuel Chocolate Air Signature Confection is a harmonious blend of textures and flavors that could become habit forming. For more information, please go to www.jemanual.com. If you want to try something that is made locally, everything is produced here and it's made with all natural ingredients. Uh, shelf life is not as long as we'll find in other stores, but that's the good thing.